Good evening. I'm hereby calling to order the May 13, 2019 meeting of the Mayfield Heights City Council. May I have a roll call, please, Vicki? Mr. Belstria? Present. Mr. DeJohn? Here. Mrs. Finney? Here. Mr. Mano? Here. Mrs. Zavetta? Here. Mrs. Snyder? Here. Mrs. Teresi? Please stand and join me in the Pledge of Allegiance. I'd like to welcome everyone this evening. We'll move on to start with the approval of the minutes from the council meeting on April 22nd, 2019. I trust everyone had a chance to read them over. Is there a motion to approve the minutes from the council meeting on April 22nd, 2019? Move. Moved by Mr. Mano, seconded by Mrs. Sabetta. Are there any suggested changes, amendments, or deletions to those minutes? Seeing none. All in favor, signify by saying aye. 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 I abstain, I was absent from the meeting. Next on our agenda, our correspondence and announcements. Does any member of council have any correspondence or announcements? Mrs. Sabetta. Thank you, Madam President. The Chagrin River Watershed Partners will have their annual meeting. They are board of directors on May 16th, Thursday at 4 p.m and Willoughby Hills Community Center. Thank you. Thank you, Mrs. Sabetta. Any other correspondence and announcements? Then we'll move on to reports of officers and we'll start with the mayor, Mayor DeZico. Thank you, Madam Chair, good evening. Um, we received word from our neighbors in Mayfield Village that beginning May 20th through August 2nd, Wilson Mills Road, east of Sam Center Road to River Road and Gates Mills will be closed. Uh, local traffic only will be permitted through there. So uh, um, there's hope that it might be finished sooner, but you know how that goes. Uh, we will uh, keep our fingers crossed, but just keep that in mind in your daily commutes uh, and travels this summer. Um, and we have posted that information to our uh, social media sites. Um, and to follow up on our uh, Arbor Day uh, planting, uh, as I reported last uh, meeting, uh, we did plant a Yoshino cherry tree in the city park near the bocce courts and I uh, just wanted to follow up because we did dedicate that tree to Lisa Benedetti in honor of her uh, over 30 years uh, of service to the city. So thank you, Lisa. And that's the same kind of tree that is planted in Washington, D.C., same type cherry. So uh, on Saturday, May 4th, we hel held our annual Shred Day for residents. Uh, once again, the event was very well attended and uh, was a great success. We collected over 12,000 pounds of paper products and nearly 4,000 pounds of electronics and computers. Uh, we also collected hazardous waste, which we transport to the county uh, for proper disposal. And I'd like to thank the service department and the auxiliary police for their assistance. Uh, this morning, I had the pleasure of attending Charlie's Philly Steaks and Wings VIP grand opening and ribbon cutting ceremony. Uh, the eatery is located on Sam Center Road across from Eastgate, and we wish them well. Uh, S Patrolman Seth Clo, I pronounced that right, didn't I, Doug? Okay. <laughs> Clue. <laughs> didn't we, Seth, did we uh, hire Seth yet? Yes, that's what I thought. I haven't been gone that long. Um, pronunciation is Clo, I believe. Okay, you're a big help, thanks, Doug. Recently joined the police department. Uh, I'm gonna call him Seth. Patrolman Seth uh, has been a state trooper for the last six years. Uh, he brings with him a wealth of knowledge and experience and uh, we're fortunate to have him. And finally, on Monday, May 27th, the city will host our annual Memorial Day service at 10 a.m. And the service will include the unveiling of our Hometown Hero Banner program. Uh, and the, as you will recall, the program honors residents who have served in our country's armed forces. So we look forward to that ceremony. And that concludes my report. Thank you, Mayor. Are there any questions from the Mayor? Seeing none, we'll move on to Director of Law, Mr. Murphy. Thank you, Madam Chairman. I have no report this evening, but I would request an executive session at the end of the regular business meeting this evening to discuss pending and imminent litigation. 
Thank you, Mr. Murphy. Are there any questions for Mr. Murphy? Seeing none, we'll move on to Director of Finance, Mrs. Fagan. Thank you, I have no report this evening. Thank you, Mrs. Fagan. Are there any questions for Mrs. Fagan? Seeing none, we will move on to our reports of committees, commissions, and boards. We'll begin tonight with the Building Committee, Mrs. Snyder. Thank you, Madam Chair. I have no report this evening. Thank you, Mrs. Snyder. Are there any questions for Mrs. Snyder? Next, we'll go on to Finance and Audit Committee, Mrs. Sabetta. Thank you, Madam President. I have no report. Thank you, Mrs. Sabetta. Any questions for Mrs. Sabetta? Seeing none, we'll move on to Legislative Committee, Mrs. Teresi. I think Mr. Um, Mano. We have no report, it. Madam Chair. No report. Any questions for Mr. Mano? Next, move on to Public Works and Service Committee, Mr. Balistria. Thank you, Madam Chairman. I have no official report this evening. Uh, the committee did not meet, uh, but I do plan on scheduling a meeting within the next couple of weeks uh, to further our discussions on our sidewalk program. Thank you, Mr. Balistria. Are there any questions for Mr. Balistria? Next, we'll move on to Safety and Train, or I'm sorry, Parks and Recreation, Mr. Mano. Thank you, Madam Chairman. On May 18th, join us for our next dinner dance of the year. Advanced registrations are a must by calling 440-442-2627. The cost is $10 per person, and the registration deadline is May 15th. Our music will be provided by DJ Jam and Joel, and we will be serving roast beef, potato, veggie, desserts, coffee, and water. Looking for something for your child to do this summer? We have several week-long camps open for the summer. Aside from our popular day camp for children entering kindergarten through sixth grade, we have several specialty camps that include tennis, cheer, baseball, fundamental basketball, volleyball, swimming, football, and speed, power, and agility. Don't miss out on swim lessons at Drag a Pool. Session, one's begin, session one begins on June 10th. Pool passes are on sale at City Hall in the Recreation Department on Monday through Friday from 8.30 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. Don't miss out on the early bird, early bird pool pass price, which ends on Friday, May 24th at 4.30 p.m. Residents must show a current gas or electric bill and a photo ID to receive resident rate. Silver Shooters Bocce, Wednesdays. June 5th through July 31st from 11.15 a.m. The cost is $32. Bocce ball really knows no age limit. It can be played and enjoyed by any age. Played under our beautiful pavilion, a simple lunch will be provided after the game. For more information on this or any other Park and Rec uh, advice, call the uh, website or visit the website or call us at 440-442-2627. That concludes my report. Thank you, Mr. Mano. Are there any questions of Mr. Mano? Next, we'll move on to safety and transportation. Mr. DeJohn. Thank you, Madam President. Uh, tomorrow morning at 7 a.m., sorry for the time, uh, we have a safety and transportation committee meeting, and we're going to be talking about a new body cam for the uh, police department. And I also want to remind all the residents of scam phone calls. Um, there's people that will call you posing as your relatives asking for money. Please verify it before you send any money. There's other scams coming uh, from the saying they're the IRS. The IRS won't call you. They'll mail to you, so please verify that. And um, if there's any pressure whatsoever to purchase anything on a phone, please disregard it and tell them you'll call them back. That concludes my report. Thank you, Mr. DeJohn. Are there any questions for Mr. DeJohn? Seeing none, we'll move on to Board of Zoning. Mrs. Sabetta. Thank you, Madam President. The Board of Zoning will meet tomorrow here in Council Chambers at 7 p.m. There are four items on the agenda. Thank you. Thank you, Mrs. Sabetta. Are there any questions for Mrs. Sabetta? Next, move on to Planning Commission. Mr. Balstria. Thank you, Madam Chairman. I have no report as there was no agenda last week for the Planning Commission. Thank you, Mr. Balstria. Are there any questions for Mr. Balstria? Seeing none, we will come to the public portion of the meeting. Pursuant to city code, each person will be allowed five minutes to speak, with a maximum of 30 minutes allowed for the entire public portion. Although this is not a time for public debate, this is your opportunity to address council with your concerns. 
please know there will be no personal attacks or comments allowed. Also, if you are here in connection with an agenda item, this is your opportunity to address the council. If you would like to be heard this evening, please raise your hand and be recognized. Then approach the podium and state your name and address for the record. It is now 7-12. I will open the public portion. Anybody like to be heard this evening? Ma'am, please come up to the podium. Thank you, Madam President, and hello to all members of council and the mayor, and um, Lisa Benedetti and Vicki Savage. My name is Lavette Hennigan, 1827 East 45th Street, Asheville, Ohio. I'm the clerk of council for the city of Asheville, and I'd like to present a token of my appreciation and love to Lisa Benedetti. So Lisa and I have gone back for years. We became clerks about the same time, and we also are roomies when we go to conferences. The city of Mayfield Heights, very gracious to me and let me room with Lisa to cut down on my cost for my travel because my city couldn't afford it. And so we roomed together, we traveled together, we laughed together. Um, I've been with her, I, I've had meals at her home, I've known her mom and dad and went through the passing of her mom and dad with her, and she's just very special to me, so I'd like to present this to her if I might. Thank you so much, please do. Thank you so much. Thank you. Sir? James Wallace with Prospectus Architecture, 13212 Shaker Square, Cleveland, Ohio, 44120. Um, I'm here tonight representing Apex Dermatology and Dr. Garcia. We're just here to answer any questions about the rezoning this evening. So if there's anything you need us to answer, please let us know. Thank you so much. Anybody else like to be heard this evening? Seeing none, we will close the public portion at 7.15 p.m. Next on our agenda is Resolution 2019-42. I'm going to ask Mrs. Snyder, my co-chair, to do this resolution since I have a personal relationship with the property owner. Thank you. Thank you. Resolution 2019-42, Mr. Murphy. Uh, thank, thank you, Madam Acting Chair. Resolution 2019-42, a resolution confirming the action of the Board of Zoning Appeals of the City of Mayfield Heights in granting to Fairchild Management Company a variance to allow a sign on the east side of the proposed self-storage building where there is no unrestricted ingress and egress to the inside of the building at 1413 Golden Gate Boulevard. Cuyahoga County Permanent Parcel Numbers 862-060-050-862-06-071-862-06-072 and 862-06-073. Second reading. Thank you. Is there a motion to place Resolution 2019-42 on second reading? Move. Moved by Mr. Mano. Second by Mr. Balistra. Roll call on the motion to place on second reading. Mr. Mano? Yes. Mr. Balistra? Yes. Mr. DeJohn? Yes. Mrs. Sabetta? Yes. Mrs. Teresi? Mrs. Snyder? Yes. Mrs. Finney? Abstain. This resolution has been placed on second reading. Moving to resolution. 2019-43, Mr. Murphy. Thank you, Madam Chair. Resolution 2019-43, a resolution confirming the action of the Board of Zoning Appeals of the City of Mayfield Heights in granting to Fairchild Management Company a variance to allow a 178 square foot identification sign on the east side of the proposed self-storage building at 1413 Golden Gate Boulevard. Cuyahoga County Permanent Parcel Numbers 
862-06-071, and 862-06-073. Second reading. Thank you. Can I have a motion to place resolution 2019-43 on second reading? Move. Moved by Mr. Mano, second by Mr. Balestrea. Roll call on the motion. Mr. DeJohn? Yes. Mrs. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Balestrea? Yes. Mr. Mano? Yes. Mrs. Sabetta? Yes. Mrs. Finney? Abstain. Thank you. This resolution will be placed on second reading. We'll now turn the meeting back over to Council President Finney. Thank you, Mrs. Snyder. Next on our agenda is resolution 2019-48. Mr. Murphy, please. Thank you, Madam Chair. Uh, resolution 2019-48, a resolution declaring May 19 through May 25, 2019 as National Public Works Week in the city of Mayfield Heights, Ohio. First reading. Thank you, Mr. Murphy. Is there a motion to suspend the rules? Move. Moved by Mr. Mano, seconded by Mrs. Snyder. Could I please have a roll call on the motion to suspend? Mrs. Sabetta? Yes. Mrs. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Mano? Yes. Mr. John? Yes. Mr. Bellustria? Yes. Mrs. Finney? Yes. Is there a motion to approve? Move. Moved by Mr. Bellustria, Second. seconded by Mrs. Snyder. Could I have um, any discussion? I think it's pretty self explanatory. National Public Works Week is May 19th through May 25th. Madam Chair? Mayor? And just if we could, um, real quick, um, we just want to thank our uh, Public Works uh, crew for everything they do in our city. Uh, they do a, an amazing job. And uh, on the streets, uh, for our residents, um, every day they're out there and they do an amazing job. So I just want to say thank you to them. Everybody would like to say thank you, especially yeah. in the winter. We have the cleanest streets, I think, around. Can we have a roll call, please, Vicki? Mr. Bell, Austria? Yes. Mrs. Sabetta? Yes. Mr. DeJohn? Yes. Mrs. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Mano? Yes. Mrs. Finney? Yes. Resolution 2019-48 has been adopted. Next on our agenda is Resolution 2019-49. Mr. Murphy, please. Thank you, Madam Chair. Uh, resolution number 2019-49, a resolution authorizing the mayor to enter into a contract with Valley Freightliner and Western Star for a cab and chassis Freightliner model 108 SD for the service department and declaring an emergency. First reading. Thank you. Is there a motion to suspend the rules? Move. Moved by Mrs. Snyder, seconded by Mr. DeJohn. Can I have a roll call on the motion to suspend, please? Mrs. Snyder? Yes. Mr. DeJohn? Yes. Mr. Mano? Yes. Mr. Bellustria? Yes. Mrs. Sabetta? Yes. Mrs. Finney? Yes. Is there a motion to approve? Move. Moved by Mr. Bellustria, seconded by Mr. DeJohn. Uh, discussion, Mr. Bellustria? Nope. <clears throat> this is uh, something that council was aware of uh, towards the beginning of the year. Uh, this and the next resolution uh, as well. Uh, the new Freightliner truck for the service department. Uh, the amounts are enclosed on both the resolutions for your approval. Thank you. Any other questions, comments? Vicki, could I have a roll call, please? Mrs. Sabetta? Yes. Mr. Mano? Yes. Mr. Bellustria? Yes. Mrs. Snyder? Yes. Mr. DeJohn? Yes. And Mrs. Finney? Yes. Resolution 2019 49 has been adopted. Next on our agenda is Resolution 2019-50. Mr. Murphy. Thank you, Madam Chair. Resolution 2019-50, a resolution authorizing the mayor to enter into a contract with Concord Road Equipment Manufacturer for a combination dump body spreader with related accessories, central hydraulic system, snow plow hitch with power angling plow, and hopper spreader for the service department declaring an emergency. First reading. Thank you, Mr. Murphy. Is there a motion to suspend the rules? Move. Move. Second. Moved by Mr. Balestria, seconded by Mr. Mano. Could I have a roll call, please, on the motion to suspend? Mr. Mano. Yes. Mr. Balestria. Yes. Mr. DeJohn. Yes. Mrs. Sabetta. Yes. Mrs. Snyder. Yes. Mrs. Finney. Yes. Is there a motion to approve? Moved by Mrs. Snyder, seconded by Mrs. Sabetta. Discussion, I think Mr. Bellis 
Drea already talked about this. Anyone else? Can I have a roll call, please, on the motion to approve? Mr. DeJohn? Yes. Mrs. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Gilstria? <laughs> yes. Mr. Mano? Yes. Mrs. Sabetta? Yes. Mrs. Finney? Yes. Resolution 2019-50 has been adopted. And next on our agenda is Ordinance 2019-10. Mr. Murphy. Madam Chair, before we uh, read this uh, ordinance again, as it's uh, as I introduced it, um, I would like to withdraw 2019-10 from the agenda. Thank you. Can I have a motion to withdraw per the mayor's request 2019-10 from the agenda, please? Moved by Mrs. Sabata, seconded by Mrs. Snyder. Can I have a roll call, please, Vicki? Mrs. Sabata. Yes. Mrs. Snyder. Yes. Mr. Mano. Yes. Mr. DeJohn. Yes. Mr. Belstria. Yes. Mrs. Finney. Yes. 2019-10 uh, will be removed from our agenda. Next will be ordinance 2019-11, Mr. Murphy. Uh, thank you, Madam Chair. Ordinance number 2019-11, an ordinance amending the zone map of the city of Mayfield Heights, Ohio so as to rezone permanent parcel numbers 861-29-003 through 861-29-005, inclusive, and 861-29-014 through 861-29-026, inclusive, consisting of 16 parcels on the undeveloped Jasmine Circle from the current U2A1 Planned Unit Development District to U7 Headquarters or Executive Offices Park District in the City of Mayfield Heights, corner of Cedar Road and Landerbrook Drive. Third reading. Thank you, Mr. Murphy. We had our public reading tonight, so we will ask for a motion to approve, please. Moved. Moved by Mr. Mano, seconded by Mrs. Sabetta. Any discussion? Vicki, can we have a roll call, please? Mr. Bellustria. Yes. Mrs. Sabetta? Yes. Mr. DeJohn? Yes. Mrs. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Mano? Yes. Mrs. Finney? Yes. Ordinance 2019-11 has been adopted. Next is Ordinance 2019-13. Mr. Murphy, please. Thank you, Madam President. Uh, ordinance number 2019-13, an ordinance amending Section 13 of Ordinance number 2018-27 providing for the organization of certain administrative departments and fixing the salaries and bonds of certain officers and employees therein. Recreation Department, Summer Staff. First reading. Thank you, Mr. Murphy. Is there a motion to suspend the rules? Moved. Moved by Mr. Mano, seconded by Mrs. Snyder. Can we please have a roll call on the motion to suspend? Mrs. Snyder. Yes. Mr. DeJohn. Yes. Mr. Mano. Yes. Mr. Lustria. Yes. Mrs. Sabetta. Yes. Mrs. Finney. Yes. Ordinance 2019-13, I'm sorry, has been adopted. Next is Ordinance 2019-14, Mr. Murphy. Thank you, Madam Chair. Oh, oh I'm sorry. Is. I'm sorry. I'm talking to him about something else. Um, we Blame need it on me. a <laughs> motion to approve, please. A motion to approve. Moved by Mrs. Sabata, seconded by Mrs. Snyder. <laughs> Discussion, Mr. Mano. Anything you want to? No, I have nothing to say. No. I thought you were Parks and Rec. You might have something to say. Oh, this is for the summer help program and and uh, the the people that run the day camps and so on. So, uh, it's it needs to be approved. Okay, thank you, Mr. Mano. Anyone else? Okay, now we'll have a roll call, please, Vicky. Mrs. Sabetta. Yes. Mr. Mano. Yes. Mr. Bellustria. Yes. Mrs. Snyder. Yes. Mr. DeJohn. Yes. Mrs. Finney. Yes. Ordinance 2019-13 has been adopted. Next is Ordinance 2019-14. Mr. Murphy. Thank you, Madam Chair. Ordinance number 2019-14, an ordinance determining the reschedule of second regular meeting of council in May 2019 for Monday, May 27, 2019 to Wednesday, May 29, 2019, and declaring an emergency. First reading. Thank you, Mr. Murphy. Is there a motion to suspend the rules? Moved by Mrs. Sabetta, seconded by Mr. Balestria. Can I have a roll call, please, on motion to suspend? 
Mr. Mano. Yes. Mr. Bellostria. Yeah. Mr. Yes. Dijon. Yes. Mrs. Sabetta. Yes. Mrs. Snyder. Yes. Mrs. Finney. Yes. Is there a motion to approve? Moved. Moved by Mr. Bellostria. <laughs> Seconded by Mrs. Snyder. Um, discussion? Mr. Dijon? Yes, this is one of the dates uh, I told uh, the clerk of councils that I couldn't make, uh, but yet you decided to schedule it on the date, which is okay. Uh, I have a meeting on that night, so, so I'm going to vote no on it. I'm sorry, I wasn't aware of that. That's okay. It, okay. Um, then anybody else? Any other discussion? Roll call, please. Mr. Dijon? No. Mrs. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Belstria? Yes. Mr. Mano? Yes. Mrs. Sabetta? Yes. Mrs. Finney? Yes. Ordinance 2019-14 has been adopted. Next are motions. We have one motion this evening. Motion A, Mr. Murphy. Thank you, Madam Chair. Uh, motion advertise for bids for three uninterruptible power supply systems, UPS, for traffic signals. Thank you, Mr. Murphy. Is there a motion to approve? Moved by Mr. DeJohn, seconded by Mrs. Sabata. Discussion, Mr. Belstria, anything? No. No, anybody? Okay, all in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Opposed? Motion A is approved. We'll turn over to our law director now. New business. <laughs> um, council adopted Resolution number 2019, I think it was 44 at the most recent meeting, which awarded a contract to Com Products and DBA BNC Communications to purchase um, radio equipment for the fire department. Um, when the finance director was preparing the purchase order, she learned that the actual contractor who would supply the radios was Motorola Solutions Inc. and the contractor who would do the installation was Com Products Inc. So we determined that the um, resolution should be uh, corrected to provide that the um, Motorola would be the contractor to supply the radios and um, Com Products would be the contractor to do the installation. So at your places this evening, there are two resolutions that I would suggest being added to the agenda. Resolution number 2019-51 and resolution number 2019-52. And what we will need is a motion to add both to the agenda and then I will read them and uh, they'll be on first reading. Council can then proceed as normal. I'm sorry, was that 2019-52 um, and 53? 51, 51 and 52? 52. Mm -hmm. I got 52. Okay, can we have a motion to place resolution number 2019-51 back on the table? Move on the agenda. On the agenda, I'm sorry. Okay, moved by Mrs. Snyder, seconded by Mrs. Sabetta. Can I have a roll call, please, Vicki? Mr. Belstria? Yes. Mrs. Sabetta? Yes. Mr. DeJohn? Yes. Mrs. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Mano? Yes. Mrs. Finney? Yes. Um, so now what do we have to do? Just have an approval or do we need a suspension? Uh, no, I, I'll do the, the reading. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Uh, resolution number 2019-51, a resolution authorizing the mayor to enter into a contract with Motorola Solutions, Inc., for the purchase of radio equipment for use by the Mayfield Heights Fire Department and declaring an emergency. First reading. Thank you, Mr. Murphy. Do we have a motion to suspend the rules? Move. Mm -hmm. Moved by Mr. DeJohn, seconded by Mr. Balestria. Roll call on the motion to suspend the rules. Mrs. Snyder? Yes. Mr. DeJohn? Yes. Mr. Mano? Yes. Mr. Balestria? Yes. Mrs. Sabetta? Yes. Mrs. Finney? Yes. Can I have a motion to approve, please? Move. Moved by Mr. Balestria. Seconded. Seconded by Mrs. Sabata, Mr. Murphy. As previously, previously stated, uh, Motorola Solutions is providing the actual radios, and the contract for that purchase 
is a cost of $175,846.06. And this is being purchased through the State of Ohio Cooperative Purchasing Program, um, in which Motorola Solutions, Inc. is one of the approved vendors. So council can approve this without authorizing competitive bidding. Thank you. Any questions? Mr. Belstria. Well, to the law director, if I may. Uh, Mr. Murphy, the, what we approved at the, uh, the last meeting in, in terms of uh, the total cost, that hasn't, that hasn't changed. That hasn't changed. It's just the, the vendor has been clarified, really. Okay. Just wanted to clarify that. Thank you. Any other questions? Can I have a roll call, please, Vicki? Mrs. Sabetta. Yes. Mr. Mano. Yes. Mr. Belstria. Yes. Mrs. Snyder. Yes. Mr. DeJohn. Yes. Mrs. Finney. Yes. Resolution 2019-51 has been adopted. Next, we're going to ask for resolution number 2019-52 to be placed on the agenda. Can I have a motion, please? Move. Moved by Mrs. Sabetta, seconded by Mr. DeJohn. Can I have a roll call, please? Mr. Mano. Yes. Mr. Belstria. Yes. Mr. DeJohn. Yes. Mrs. Sabetta. Yes. Mrs. Snyder. Yes. Mrs. Finney. Yes. Next, we will ask for a motion to suspend the rules. Moved by Mrs. Snyder, seconded by Mr. Belstria. Can I have a roll call on the motion to suspend, please? Mr. DeJohn. Yes. Mrs. Snyder. Yes. Mr. Belstria. Yes. Mr. Mano. Yes. Mrs. Sabetta. Yes. Mrs. Finney. Yes. Can I have a motion to approve? Oh, Can I'm sorry. Read, read oh, you didn't read this one. That's I right. didn't read oh. this one very well. Go ahead. Okay, this is resolution number 2019-52, well. a resolution authorizing the mayor to retain Com Products Inc., DBA, BNC Communications, for the installation of radio equipment for use by the Mayfield Heights Fire Department, and declaring an emergency. First reading. Thank you. Now we will ask for a motion to approve. Move. Moved by Mr. DeJohn, second by Mrs. Sabata. Um, Mayor, did you want to explain why we put this on so last minute, or are we all clear on this? Got it? <laughs> okay. Um, under conversation with the vendor, it became clear that the actual PO had to be made out to Motorola, so we needed to make that correction. The reason that it came to you at uh, with such a short turnaround time is we there's a rebate program in our current radios. In order to get that rebate refund on the current radi radios, we needed to make sure this was passed. Thank you. It was just a little bit of a surprise because he told me like halfway through the meeting. <laughs> okay, could we have a motion to, um, to, or we could have a roll call please, Vicki. Mrs. Sabetta. Yes. Mrs. Snyder. Yes. Mr. Mano. Yes. Mr. DeJohn. Yes. Mr. Belstria. Yes. Mrs. Finney. Yes. Resolution 2019-52 has been adopted. Next, we will um, ask for a motion to adjourn to executive session. Moved by Mrs. Sabata, seconded by Mrs. Snyder. Can we have a roll call, please? Mr. Belstria? Yes. Mrs. Sabata? Yes. Mr. DeJohn? Yes. Mrs. Snyder? Yes. Mr. Mano? Yes. Mrs. Finney? Yes. If everybody would hang tight, we're gonna make this really short, so because we don't want, this is our last meeting with Lisa, so.